Welcome back to Bobblehead Homestead. I am Jeff. I am not at either of the Bobblehead Homesteads. I am over at uh, Come On Homesteading. David up here on Come On Mountain is having an eclipse party. We are, uh, what time is it? Uh, we're probably like 20 minutes away from total eclipse time. Um, I forgot to bring a chair. So he's got these nice chairs on the back side of his house here. So I'm, uh, I'm just catching a little break for a few minutes before I go back over to the festivities. Uh, beautiful day, upper 70s, hardly any breeze. There are some clouds. There are some clouds. It's not completely cloudy, but uh, yeah, we'll see. I've got a little filter thing for my iPhone and but i've been looking at it it's already a partial eclipse right now and uh yeah the cheap old iphones are they are what they are but yeah good time we'll see if i get some more footage uh of the festivities over there um just a lot of people and it's hard to film in those conditions and i'm uh, hopefully everybody else has some videos coming out I still don't have much of a voice today. See, that's what I should be doing, is just going around and getting all of them to talk for me. That's an idea. All right, uh, break time is over. I'll see you in a bit. It's getting dark now. Yeah, now that the plan is over, we got work to do. Um, Jen and Wiley, our mound home, they decided last night they're gonna bring a, a bus down. It's back there somewhere. So yeah, they came all the way from Oklahoma today on their first trip. And uh, Drew is gonna, the bus doesn't run. So uh, Drew's backhoe, he's up here with Lindsay and kids. And uh, they're gonna use Drew's backhoe to uh, finish getting it up and situated on his property. So yeah, party over at David's and now we're over at my new place. Uh, get ready to move a bus for Jen and Wiley to Jen and Wiley's new place. Yeah, how awesome is this community? Well, who showed up in Arkansas today? When did you plan this trip? Yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. About four o'clock. Yeah, about, about three or four o'clock yesterday afternoon. Yeah, <laughs> one trip down and four, five, oh, six, 10, 12. Ten. <laughs> We're not even sure yet. We're yeah. gonna start loading trailers tomorrow. Yeah, so today you brought down which bus? Lily's bus. Yep. So we brought Lily's bus today. It's back in its position where it goes. It needs to be leveled. Yeah. But it's where it needs to be. And uh, yeah, then Friday 
it looks like everybody's going to be showing up and try to get all the rest of it moved. Yep, or Saturday, Friday and Saturday. Friday day and Saturday, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'll be helping. We're here to help. Yeah. yeah Just like we... Drew was here today. Right. Yeah. So you put, you parked your van here and un took it off the trailer because that trailer is no way. Oh, there's no way. Yeah. We barely made this corner down here with it. Yeah. Or my, I had to get out and get My truck in. tire was right on the edge of the drop off for that. Uh, Culvert. Yeah, the tin horn. And then the trailer come just right on the edge of it on the other side. So it was it was really tight. All right. So you just took it off the trailer here and drew drug me in with drug the it home with the backhoe. Yep. Yes. Yep. And then Wiley went crashing down the hill. Into yes. its spot. On purpose. <laughs> on purpose. On purpose. Yes. It was a controlled crash. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Did yeah. you hit anything? Nope. No. Nope. Some big holes. He, he got it right where it needed to go. Drew just had to push him in just a little bit further. Yep. Video yeah. or it didn't happen. Yeah. It did. It uh, did. Well, so we got video. So, yeah. yeah. Drew has it. Home. You Drew got... has it, and I have it. Yeah, I was down here talking to neighbors. I missed it. <laughs> so, like, if you're like me and you missed it, got to go watch their videos. Right. Yeah. Right. And Lindsay got a totally different perspective than I got. So. Beautiful. Yeah, you might want to watch both of them. I don't know. Nice. And I heard a jar break inside the bus. And so we haven't figured out yet bad. what it is. Uh -oh. Surely it's pickles. <laughs> hopefully it's pickles and not like jelly yeah. yeah yeah anyway we still have a lot of work to do a lot it's gonna be a long drive home yeah, yeah you're driving home tonight it, it's gonna be pretty what time is it late i don't time know we got... and i forgot my phone at home six oh, yeah. o'clock holy oh, moly yeah it's gonna be 10 o'clock before we yeah. get home it doesn't get dark till eight now so yeah. i'm good for another 45 minutes <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's, it's gonna be 10 o'clock when we get home well they got dark at 1 30 actually yeah, it did. I got that on film. You'll see it yeah. before you see this. We, I, I we tried got to. Some we were going down film. the road. Yeah. We was going down the road, coming over here, and Jen had the camera hanging out the window trying to get some of it. But, but I don't the know. road was really bumpy, and Wiley's truck does not have great suspension. So, it uh, yeah, it might be a little bit jiggly. I'm not sure. <laughs> Go check out Jeff's video. His camera was probably yeah. sitting on the ground where it's still. Yeah, and I, I just had a, a cell phone. I have video of the party mm -hmm. to show it was how dark it got. It you was, know. But yeah. I had a, my cell phone aimed at it, and it didn't. It was kind of Very eerie, sharp. actually. To me, I was like, whoa, it's getting dark. And then it started getting dark really fast. I mean, within minutes, it was stars came out yeah yep. uh-huh yeah i saw some stars but i was driving i didn't get to pay attention to that kind of stuff yeah well there's lots cool. of youtube videos about it i promise did you turn your headlights on yeah yeah yeah, yeah i seen the cops reminded me they had a big sign out there that says um the sun's out or the sun's off lights headlights off. on uh, yeah like <laughs> so yeah <laughs> <laughs> there were people lining like any like a tractor supply there in Greenwood. There was people in that big parking oh, it lot, was and there was people. At, Walmart parking lot was full. Everybody was just sitting on the, the little road. the little area there where they have the cleared areas without a lot of trees, so yeah. you get a good mm -hmm. the little area where they have the the food trailers all set up. It was cram packed with people. Crazy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about the outside valve? It's on now. Oh, oh. oh. Got a bunch of air pockets. Yeah. No yeah. leaks. Nothing at it yet. The little phone the way you have to so good. Yeah. Plus, open there. Well, that's probably just the air and water coming through. Oh, yeah, yeah. Do that. And you said this drain's hooked up, right? Yeah. Oh, that's hot side. Look at that. How does that open? Maybe it twists, like spin it. I was hate to that sink. <laughs> How does that work? 
Gotta have a twist lock on it. Yeah, but it's finicky. <laughs> it shut off? Yep. Yeah. Look here. All right, Wiley. You're gonna be my new superhero. Do, do I get to uh, do you get the, the first <laughs> one? See what happens. Oh my goodness. It did exactly what it's supposed to yes, do. Yes, it did. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody knew what they was doing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to Gary Junk to Gems. He did a lot of that. <laughs> Come here, little girl. I'm gonna snag you. Oh, I almost got her. Fifi acts like she wants me to. She wants some scratches, but if she gets close enough for scratches, sometimes I snag her and put her in my lap to give her scratches. And she'll stay until I stop scratching, but uh, she doesn't like it when I try to grab her. All right, so it is the next night, Tuesday night. Um, I still don't have a voice, much of one anyway. Probably should have stayed home yesterday and rested, but how much fun was that? Oh, wow, big, huge thank you to David at Come On Homesteading. Uh, grilled up some fine stuff. Lots of other people uh, brought food, you know, potluck style. Uh, I think he said there were more than 30 people there. Um, just a great day uh, sharing in, a, you know, almost a once-in-a-lifetime event. That total eclipse was wild. It was really wild. I saw one when I was a kid back in Illinois. Uh, probably been, what, late 70s? Yeah, late 70s. And we didn't have all the glasses and everything back then. But I remember... Um, I was in school that day and we went outside and the science teacher made those little pinhole boxes so you could see it uh, projected on the back of the box. Um, so that was really cool. I remember that one when, when I was a kid. So I think all those kids that were there yesterday, they're going to they're gonna have a memory of that, uh, hopefully, like I did. I remember that was a good time. It was really cool. And, uh, you know, the totality, it happens every once in a while on, in the world. It's just, you know, it hit us 100% on this one. And like in Illinois back in the 70s, that was 100%. But, you know, sometimes it's in the middle of the ocean uh, that it's 100%. So, uh, anyway, enough about that. It was an awesome, awesome day. Go check out uh, Come On Homesteading. Um, they did a live show. And he's got a link to everybody who was there. Uh, the usual uh, usual crew of awesome, awesome people and uh, just having a good time. And then uh, we weren't done yet. Then we went over to my new place because, as you saw, Jen and Wiley brought down one of their buses. Um, you know, uh, kind of a last-minute trip. They, they figured they'd do it. Wiley knew that he was going to have to drive pretty slow pulling that bus. Um, so if we did, if he did that when it was a big group of us, he would have slowed us all down. So he figured he'd uh, do that yesterday and get that one out of the way so he didn't slow us down on Friday. And yeah, that was awesome. So, uh, and that trailer was just huge that he had that bus on. So uh, there was no way he was going to get that trailer back into their property. So Drew and I went over there and Drew fired up his backhoe and uh, pulled, the, pulled the bus up the hill and back into their property. And it is uh, there and uh, they got to level it out and stuff, but it will be ready to go. So it was good to see them yesterday. And of course, at the end of the day, we're sitting around just chit-chatting and talking. I'm like... Hey, Wiley, why don't we go look at my plumbing? Because <laughs> I do that. I'm sneaky. you got to be careful around me. I'm going to sign you up for work when you least expect it. I, I freely admit that, that I'm, I'm uh, devious like that, though. But, yeah, so they got, the, they got the toilet flushing and ready to go. So when people come Friday, Saturday, 
we will have a working toilet. Um, we needed to cap off a couple lines and uh, him and Drew did it all. So it's it's not all done. Not all the, the drain and the shower still has to be done. The kitchen sink isn't done yet. But we wa I wanted it to at least be done enough for the toilet to work on Friday and Saturday when we got folks coming and going. Now if we can get that shower going before Jen and Wiley move, they'll have a place to take a shower for a while. Oh, uh, what else can I tell you? I, I took it easy today. I got a nice three-hour nap in. Um, just put the chickens to bed. It just got dark a few minutes ago. And, uh, what's tomorrow? Wednesday? Yeah, I'm not going anywhere tomorrow if I don't have to. So, alright, I will let you guys go. What an awesome, awesome day yesterday. Not just, you know, partying and playing for the eclipse, but then afterwards, uh, people getting together and making dreams come true. Uh, everybody was helping each other. Oh yeah, Drew had a back t had a flat tire, but that always happens. We expect that. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for everything. Take it easy.